Hi guys, it's Roxy, and I'm back with another drawing tutorial. Today I will be teaching you how to draw a cartoon of Stampy. Stampy uploads gaming videos to his YouTube channel called Stampy Longhead, who has over 5 million subscribers. I thought I'd teach you how to draw Stampy because I enjoy his videos myself and I thought this video would appeal to a lot of his fans. For this drawing, you will need two colouring in pencils for his eyes and his face. You'll need a pencil so that when we're drawing him we don't make any mistakes and we can easily rub them out. And we'll need a rubber and we'll need a thin black pen for going over the lines at the end to make Stampy look more bold. So let's get started. So for the first part of this drawing I will be having my sketchbook portrait because I find doing these first few steps with your paper this way much easier. So first step one is to draw a capital C. So I'll just focus that and we're going to go and let me just budge. So it's a capital C And after that, we are going to draw a smaller C. So it's going to come down and round. So we've drawn a capital C and then a slightly thinner C curving down and ending slightly longer than the first C. So that's his face and that's his area with his mouth and nose. So next we are going to turn our paper horizontal and we are going to draw a smaller C or half circle depending what you want to call it just in the centre that's where his nose is and we are going to draw a Y shape So there's a semicircle, and our Y comes down from there. And now we are going to draw his mouth. So for his mouth, all we are going to draw do is draw a J, but slightly curved at an angle. So there's his mouth, as you will probably know. Alright, the next step is to draw a M at each side, which is kind of like his whiskers. So we'll just extend this line slightly further, and we'll extend this line a little bit. So all we are going to do, this is really simple, is we're going to draw an M. as you can see because I zoomed in and we're going to do the exact same on the other side so let me just zoom, oh it's a bit I'll just leave it, you can see what I'm doing so there's his whiskers and now we are going to draw a C. We might want to turn our page for this. I'll just. And we are going to draw a C just below his mouth. Make sure it's equally proportioned on each side. So there should be about that much space between the whiskers and the C that we've just drawn. And then we are going to slightly extend it because I think it should be a little bit bigger. And I'll just focus. And we're going to draw a like a C but backward connecting this area to the whiskers. Some of you may be starting to recognise the stampy face. 
and we're just going to rub out some of these lines here to neaten it up. So, there we go. May not be perfect, but I'm sure you can all make it look really good when you take your time. And now we are going to draw his ears. So we're going to turn our page upside down once again and we are going to draw our ears um, we're going to start a line from here Stampy has quite big ears and I'll focus that and it comes out at an angle here And we're going to do the same on the other side. Basically just a V shape, but slightly more angular than you'd probably draw at school. Stampy Cat's ears. I think this is coming along really nicely. And of course, all of you are wondering, where's his eyes? Well, they're coming right up. So, for the eyes, we are going to put our notebook once again to portrait. And we are going to draw some curved Ds. So, we can kind of do them in line with the ears, so drawing the ears was a good idea because... So we're going to start them about here, I'd say. And we're just doing a... Wait, we'll start them about... We'll start them here. And we're doing... Following this curve, bringing it down... So these are like his eyelids. And we'll do it on the other side. So I've drawn a hot, basically a kind of moon shape, but you could also call it a capital D, which has been slightly dented. So we'll do the other same on the other side. And do the exact same, starting out there. Bringing it round. And there we go. There's Stampy's eyelids. <laughs> and of course, we need to do his pupils. So we are going to draw a U, starting about here, that, that much on each side, and bringing it down to touch his the line here and we'll do the same one step at a time bring it down to that line and of course one of the last things we're going to, one of the last things we're going to do in pencil is draw him his pupils so we're going to draw another line like another U shape in here. So that's just two U shapes. On each side. And of course we are going to need to add some pupils. So we're going to draw, basically to, the simplest way to draw a pupil is to draw a little square. So the little square is going to be just there, if you can look at the eye, it's just there, and I'll zoom out, and we'll do the same on the other side, so we'll do it on Export a bit more stampyish now. So of course we are going to need to colour stampy in. So for this I am going to use two colouring pencils. Orange and green. 
First of all, we are going to start off doing Stampy's eyes. So I'm going to um, show you a little bit how to do it and then just skip ahead till I've done all of it so that it doesn't take so long to watch me all doing it all because that would be a bit boring. So we're just colouring his eyelids green. And we'll do the same on the other side. Okay, I'll cut this bit out because you don't need to see all that. So there's Stampy's pretty groovy looking eyelids. So now we are going to do this bit green. So, as you can see, it looks really good. So we're going to do it on this area down here and this area down here. So I'll skip ahead. Okay, so I've coloured in this part of Stampy's eyes. And now we are going to get our special black pen with a fine tip, as you can see, and go over this little pupil. And then we're going to colour in this white area here, black, leaving out that little cube, because Stumpy doesn't have black pupils. And the same on the other side. Oh, my pen's running out. Yeah, I'll skip. So, all right. So I've coloured that area and that area in black. And now it's time to colour him orange because everyone knows Stampy is an orange kitty cat. So all of this area, his ears his other ear, but not this area, or his nose. Leave his nose alone, and his whiskers, and his mouth. So we're just colouring in everything apart from those areas, these areas, so all this top half. So, everything around here, and around here, and around here. Okay, I'll cut ahead till I've coloured him in all orange. Alright, so I've coloured the top of Stampy all orange, so on the bottom half, if you're familiar with what the Stampy cartoon looks like, everything apart from the mouth and his nose is all left white. So for the nose, we're going to get our pencil once again, and we're going to draw a small shadow line. So I just drawed, drew a small C down there, half circle at the top of the line and we're going to get our trusty black pen and we're going to focus on the nose so we're going to go round just outline it so we know what we're doing and we're going to leave this white spot white and colour the rest of his nose black so there's Stampy Cat's nose, and for the mouth, we're just going to do the same, except we're not going to leave a shadow line. There's his mouth, and we are going to go over the whole of Stampy. So I'm going to go over his ears in black, his eyes, and everything. So we'll go over this all in black to make our Stampy cartoon stand out and look really, really cool. Comment down below what your favourite Stampy series is. Mine would be Stampy's Sims series and his Stampy's 
Minecraft Lovely World series. I would definitely recommend watching him because he works with a lot of other YouTubers to make his videos really funny and his videos haven't got any bad language in and they're like make you feel really happy and they're fun for everyone even if you're 15 or even if you're 5 so yeah there's our Stampy oh wait no I've not done his eyes So here is Stampy Cat. Doesn't he look great? So thank you for watching. I hope you really enjoyed watching this tutorial. Please tell your friends and if they're big Stampy fans they can come over and watch this and then they'll be able to know how to draw Stampy as well. So if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up. Remember to comment down below your favourite Stampy series and I'll be back soon for another tutorial. Bye guys!